Hi everyone, welcome to my video. In this video, I'll be sharing with you my summer beauty essentials. And these are some of my favorite products of all time in this video, and I can hardly wait to share them with you. But first, I'd like to thank Walmart for partnering with me in this video on their Here For Every Beauty campaign. In this campaign, Walmart is expressing their belief that beauty is for everyone, that beauty is all inclusive, regardless of your size or shape, your skin color, even your age, and I am a 50 plus beauty, we will say. Regardless of any of that, each of us is beautiful in our own way. You know, a long time ago, I was the hostess of a children's show called One of a Kind, and one of the main tenets of that show was that each of us are one of a kind and special. And really, I still believe that to this day in terms of beauty. Each of us are one of a kind and special, and with a little effort and a little planning, we can bring out our own natural beauty. Each of us can be a beauty, and I'm so glad that Walmart is here for every beauty. And I will say, just on a personal note, that I love Walmart. First, I absolutely love saving money, and there's no place better to do that. And I do my grocery shopping there, and I'm really there two or three times a week. I hate to admit it because I'm not a great planner. And when I'm there, I pick up my skincare items. But the main thing I like about Walmart, and I use it as kind of a reward after I finish my grocery shopping, is that now they have those little areas, those makeup areas that are cordoned off. And it's just a wonderful little treat to go in that area. They have beautiful, well-lit aisles. I can see all the new makeup. I can buy some of the new makeup. And it just makes me kind of happy to be in there. But you know, I always thought of Walmart as primarily drugstore type cosmetics, more inexpensive, more lower end. But recently they have unveiled their premium makeup line. And I'm going to put a link to that part of their website below because you need to go there. It is really amazing. When I go in there, it has a little bit of a spa, a very relaxing feel, and it has all of the premium brands listed on the left side. And so you can go and choose the brand you want. And these aren't just the normal brands that you have seen at Walmart in the past. It's all of my favorite brands. Too Faced, love their eyeshadow. Kat Von D, another great eyeshadow company. MAC, love pretty much everything about them. Smashbox, and I'll be showing you a couple of Smashbox products. Benefit Brow is one, Clinique is one, even IT Cosmetics. Almost any high-end brand you can think of is now right there on Walmart's website, and they have free two-day shipping with a $35 purchase. So in addition to shopping right in Walmart, I will be going online to their website because it's pretty phenomenal. Okay, let's get into my summer beauty essentials. Now, the first thing in terms of summer, actually all year round, is to make sure we have good skincare going on a consistent basis. And this is a little basic that I've used for years and I always purchase this from Walmart. This is the Cetaphil Gentle Skin Cleanser. I think I was first directed to this by my first dermatologist when I had acne in high school, and I've been using it on and off ever since. And since I started Retin-A, it is really my go-to cleanser because it totally cleanses your skin, and yet it's gentle. Now, my next two summer beauty faves, and I really can't do without them. I've used them for the last year and a half and absolutely love them. These are the CeraVe AM and PM moisturizers. And the thing I like about these is that even though they are a very reasonable price, they have great cosmeceutical ingredients. They have ceramides, which protect our skin's barrier. They have niacinamide, which is a skin brightener, which gets rid of those little brown spots we have and makes our skin have a more even skin tone. And I've really noticed that since using them. And they also contain hyaluronic acid, which is a wonderful moisturizer. Absolutely love these products. Now the PM product does not have sunblock, of course, but the AM product I really appreciate has a 30 SPF. Now our next summer beauty essential is sunscreen. And ladies, it's not even for summer. We need to be wearing sunscreen every single day of the year. And this is one of my favorites. This is the Australian Gold Botanical Sunscreen and it has an SPF of 50. And even if you wear a lower SPF in the winter, in the summer, you really need that good sun protection every single day, not just when you're going out to the pool. This is a wonderful sunscreen, and it's actually a physical sunscreen which contains zinc oxide. However, unlike a lot of other zinc oxide sunscreens, it really doesn't go on white. They have it in a little tan base. It almost goes on looking a little like a foundation, but the thing I love about this is that if you use Retin-A or Retinols that are a little bit irritating on your skin, this sunblock works wonderfully with those products. For all of us smart beauties who are kind of avoiding the sun, self-tanners are very important and Walmart has a full range of self-tanners on its website and in the store. I particularly like these two because I'm a fair person, so I really don't want a hugely dark tan because my face would look like a white peg head and then my body would be Malibu Ken or something like that. 
I really like the natural look that these Jergens Natural Glow Tanners give you. And I went ahead and used it last night. And as you can see, it looks like I have a nice little believable tan going. I like these products because they don't mess up your hands. And how these work is that you apply them to your skin like a moisturizer and over time it creates a wonderful natural looking tan. Really it works very quickly for me since I don't want to be super dark because if I put them on one night the next morning I look pretty darn good. And if I do it three days in a row I get a nice kind of golden tan and I do that sometimes before a vacation when I want to appear a little darker. But this is the Jergens Natural Glow Wet Skin Moisturizer and basically you can hop out of the shower when your skin is still damp and apply this. And this is the Jergens Natural Glow Daily Moisturizer and you use this just like any lotion you would use on your body. In fact, if you want to stay golden year round, you could use this as your body lotion because it really does soften your skin. And one thing I noticed when I was on Walmart's website is that both of these products also come in a firming version. And I've not tried that yet, but with our thighs as they get when we get a little past 50, I think the firming version may be wonderful. Now, another summer beauty essential since we're out and about so much and with so many people is to give our skin a natural smooth glow. And how I do that is with a good foundation primer. So before I apply my makeup, I applied this Smashbox Photo Finish pore minimizing primer and I have used this really for the past two years on and off and I really love it and in fact I hadn't used it in a while and I started using it a few days ago and I was blown away by how it really does null out the pores. And then we also need smooth eyelids and I will say that I applied this in the wrong order. Normally I apply my primer to my face and then my lid primer but for some reason I forgot that that's why I have foundation on in that part of the video. But basically you just smooth this on your eyelids. Not only does it smooth out your eyelids and get rid of that little bit of crepiness that we can tend to have, it also evens out the color and more importantly it helps your eyeshadow last and last. After we put on our primers, it's important to have a wonderful foundation and this is a great one. This is truly one of my faves. In fact, I'll put a link below to a video I did about this specific foundation. This is the L'Oreal Infallible 24 Hour Fresh Wear Foundation. I don't know if it wears 24 hours, but it certainly wears all through the day and into the evening. And I like that it gives me just a little bit of a matte look, but yet not that cakey, dusty matte look. It just smooths out all your imperfections. I have a lot of red veins around my nose. It totally covers those up. I apply this with a flat foundation brush. I spray the brush first with a setting spray to help this foundation apply even more smoothly. Absolutely love this foundation and it comes in an all-inclusive range of colors. Everything from very light to dark and golden. Next I do my eyebrows and I have two favorites that I've been using a lot lately. The first is the L'Oreal Brow Stylist Definer in the color blonde. For those of you blondes out there, this is really natural looking blonde color. And if you're like most blondes, you want your eyebrows to be just a little bit darker because we tend to have these brown roots and so it really brings the eyebrows in to have a slightly darker color. And this blonde doesn't go orange on you and it really lasts all day and it has a little spoolie here too. And then I set it with this NYX Control Freak. I have been using this for about the past year and a half. It just has a little mascara type applicator and you just smooth it on and the clear gel just sets your brows and keeps them in place. Now in terms of eyeshadow, I ordered this from Walmart online and I love it. As you know who watch my channel, I love Stila products and this is a great little eyeshadow palette. And here it is, if I can get it open. Look at those colors, absolutely beautiful. And it comes in two different colors, the light color that you can see, which is great if you have fair skin, and a darker color, which is great if you're medium to dark tone. Although I have to admit, I love this palette so much that I'm going to be ordering the darker one too because I do like dramatic eyes. And by the way, my eyes are a little bit dramatic today. I decided to do a kind of dramatic summer evening type makeup, and I've used a teal eyeliner, which I'll show you in a minute, and I love it. I think you would love this palette if you really like the neutrals. Here is the color that I have on my lids. Look at that, absolutely beautiful and shimmery. Here is the darker color that I have in my crease and I used a little bit of this lighter color in there to blend that out too. That is under my brow. This past week I've been using this palette and it also comes with two beautiful blushes. Very, very natural. Here they are a darker pink one and a lighter pink one. I think the light is a little bit too light for me, but if you have fair skin, you might apply this first with a little bit of this on the apple of your cheek. This is a lovely palette and in just a week, it's truly become one of my favorites. 
Now this next palette is something I have just swatched. I have not used it yet, but I'm so excited about it. And it's a very reasonably priced palette. I think the Stila palette is just over $30 on Walmart's website, which as you know, for a high-end makeup, that's a very good deal. And this one I think is around $14, $15. And here it is. Look at those absolutely gorgeous natural colors but it does include a peach and a purple, and I think that is a great color to use in the halo part of your eyelid. Here is a look at all four of those CoverGirl palettes to give you some idea of the range of colors available. Although the palette I have is very neutral, as you can see, several of the other palettes have wonderful, very dramatic colors. If you're interested in adding a little more color to your eyeshadow collection, you might check these out. Now to finish up my eyes, I've used three of my favorite products. The first is this L'Oreal Voluminous Primer, and that is a little white eyeshadow primer that goes on clear, and it really does add volume and length to your lashes. It kind of bulks them up, and I've topped that primer with L'Oreal Voluminous Lash Paradise, and this is kind of an iconic mascara. It gives you great volume and length. It doesn't smudge. It lasts all day. This is an absolutely gorgeous mascara, and if you would prefer a more natural-looking mascara, I have loved this since I came on YouTube several years ago. This is the CoverGirl Lash Blast Volume. It makes your lashes look long and glorious and it doesn't clump. But the special item that I used on my eyes today is a teal eyeliner. And I bought this at Walmart maybe the end of last summer and this is the first time I have used it. And I think sometimes in the summer when we're wearing so many bright colors, it kind of helps to use a poppy color of liner underneath our eyes and I've taken it underneath my eyes and actually over my eyes too. And as you can see, although it gives you slight glimpses of the blue, it is not overpowering. Here is a look at that. Really nice little tip and it is a beautiful teal color. And if you're thinking about a teal eyeliner, this is a great one because it goes on very smoothly. It lasts all day long and what a great color. Now the next product that I applied to my face is blush and I love blushes. They just wake up your face, give you a little radiance. They are absolutely beautiful. And this one is especially so. This is the Physician's Formula Butter Blush and it is in the color Vintage Rouge. And the thing I particularly like about this particular color and this brand is that it is a nice peachy pink, so it's very natural, and it has just the slightest little bit of glow. I don't know if you can see that, but I really like these blushes that give you a little bit of glow on the cheeks because you don't have to apply a separate highlighter. Absolutely love this one. And another all-time favorite, which I didn't apply today because my eyes are so dramatic, I wanted to calm down the blush a little bit, but this is the Flower Beauty Flower Pots Blush in the color Wild Rose. Look at that, absolutely a beautiful fuchsia-ish pink. And it's actually one of the fuchsias that I can wear and that still somehow looks natural. And to me, even though this is a lower end blush in terms of its price, it's because I think the price is well under $10, even though it's a great price, to me, it applies and wears like a very high-end blush. Now, the next product is something I have been adoring lately. And in fact, I can hardly make myself use any other bronzer. This is the L'Oreal True Match Bronze It Bronzer. And here it is. And as you can see, you get a ton of product. And I think it's maybe a little over $10, but here is how it looks. And the thing I particularly like about this bronzer is how natural the colors are. Look at that. I have it in the color light and they have two more colors, a little bit darker each time, of course. And as you can see, I have this bronzer under my cheekbones, on the sides of my nose, a little bit on my forehead. But the thing I really like about it is that the color is so subtle and natural, you really can't overdo it. Now the next three products are lip products and I absolutely love going into the Walmart and looking at all the lipsticks. They are displayed beautifully and you can really tell what colors would suit you. The first thing I've applied is a little lip pencil and this is the Rimmel Exaggerate Lip Pencil in the color East End Snob and that is a little bit of an iconic lip pencil. A lot of YouTubers love it. I really like it because it goes with a lot of lipsticks because it really is about the same color as a natural lip. It's kind of that your looks but better lip liner. And I've topped it with this L'Oreal Color Reshine Lipstick in the color 906 Burnished Blush. And here is that color and it is what I have on my lips. Isn't that absolutely gorgeous? Rather than sticking with the nudes all summer long as I tend to do, sometimes I like to pop it up with a little color. I'll go ahead and apply this again so you can see it fresh. There we go. Isn't that beautiful? And you can wear that on its own. It has just a subtle little bit of shine, but usually I like to apply a little bit of gloss. I'm kind of getting over the totally matte look, although this is not a matte look. If you really want to shine it up, there is a great new product at Walmart that I am loving. 
This is the Milani Keep It Full Lip Gloss, and it is in the color 13 Rosewood. Here it is, a beautiful rose. And I really like roses because I think they're kind of a universal color that most people can wear. And I just apply a little bit at the center of my lips here. There you go. I think these three products together give your lips a beautiful rosy pop. Well, that was a look at my Walmart Summer Beauty Essentials, and I've linked all the products below the video for you. And if you're not a subscriber, I hope you'll click that bell and or give me a thumbs up. And I always like to leave you with a little thought for the day, and I've been reading from this Miracles Now card deck. These were written by Gabrielle Bernstein, who has written many kind of positive thinking books, and she is amazing. Let's go ahead and choose a card and see what we can think about for today. Ooh, I like this one. I can find peace in every breath. I can find peace in every breath. Friends, that is an absolutely wonderful card and it's something that I really need to remember because sometimes as we go through our days, we have more and more to do and we get kind of crazy feeling and really our breath gets out of control. It's at those times that we need to remember that we can find peace in our breath. So friends, just for today, if our day starts to get a little bit stressful, let's remember to slow down and stop and breathe. Take care, and I'll see you in my next video.